The unannounced Samsung Galaxy S7, which recently entered the rumor mills, is now being said to sport a magnesium alloy frame. The glass back panel would stay the same as seen with Galaxy S6 earlier this year, said Weibo. The build is said to make the smartphone sturdier than before and carry a more premium feel. As per my drivers, via Samobile the upcoming flagship handset would include the Sabre 9018 AQ2M audio chip by S-Technology, letting users listen to high FI grade audio. The chip is said to feature 129 decibels signal to noise ratio and support PCM up to 32 bit and 384 kHz along with DSD 11.2 mHz sampling. The chip will take up 1 MW in standby mode and not more than 40 MW even in heavy usage. Samsung however, is yet to confirm any of the aforementioned features or the existence of the Galaxy S7 itself. In addition, Samsung had been granted a patent for pressure-sensitive touch display technology, similar to Apple's 3D touch feature. The patent revealed by Curry and Intellectual Property Office describes how the device would throw different software results based on how hard the display is pressed. The pressure is said to be measured via different voltage levels. For instance, if users presses the key A, they would get a lower case letter. However, pressing the key further would make the letter uppercase. The patent comes at the time when Samsung is said to use an Apex Player Force pressure sensitive touch solution for its next Galaxy smartphones specifically, the Galaxy S7. Earlier this week, the report said that Samsung would be unveiling the rumored Galaxy S7 smartphone as soon as January next year. This however, contradicts the South Korean tech giant's traditional launch of flagship smartphones during the Mobile World Congress trade show, which usually takes place between late February and early March. Nothing can be confirmed for now.